Hi, my name is Gio Perez, and today I'm going to teach you uh, jab cross, or in the, what I call it is a one two, the old one two. Because so, um, on the last video, uh, we practiced how to put our hands up, right? Body a little bit to the side, chin down, and we practice our jab, right? This one, all it is, is the same movement. You're moving in a little bit forward. Remember that foot in the back is the one bringing you in. By the way, there's different styles of uh, the way you protect yourself. Uh, there's some styles where, you know, traditional is, I would say you, you stand a little bit forward, the hands a little bit on front, so you're able to parry and move it around. Uh, I like doing, I like putting my hands back. Uh, the reason is uh, you don't allow that person to see and then you're able to uh, move around and be able to be predictable in the way you're moving in when you're coming in with your punches. So. I like to keep my hands inside. But I mean, you can stand on front, you could actually put your hands on front. Uh, when I'm actually fighting myself, when I'm sparring, I, I tend to keep my hands a little bit down because I know uh, the distance I have uh, when I'm fighting or sparring with somebody. But I love doing this once I'm getting close to that person. So uh, going back to the old one too, right? So we started the last time, chin down, body sideways, protecting yourself throwing that jab, remember that, right? But today we're gonna to do that jab, but then you're gonna do a cross. Now you're, with the cross, you're moving that hip, right? So even when you're doing that jab, it's that jab forward and hip to cross. So it's jab and move your hip to cross. Jab, move your hip to cross, right? Jab, move your hip to cross and you're pushing that hip forward. Ah, so you're still, you got, you got to feel your weight coming in on every punch. It's not just the hands, it's not just the arms. No, it's your body that's bringing your whole energy in. So it's your jab and right coming in. Jab, right. Jab, right to your target. Always protect. Jab, this one, don't forget, always come back home. Right, come back home. Not this, you don't wanna drop this. You don't wanna throw jab, drop, and punch, no. It's a no-no, okay? Always jab, bring it back to the face. Jab, bring it back to the face, right. Jab, right, and again, hip movement. Very important, the hip movement is very important. So the power is coming from that, the hip, Watch it come, it's coming up from all the way from the back leg with the hip coming in and you're putting all that energy into this target, to this, uh, you know, to your fist to be able to hit that target. So one more time, body sideways, protect, chin down, jab, bring back to, to your face and punch with your right. One more time, jab, bring down to your face, and punch, jab, and right. Don't forget, always, right, always. Light on your feet, light on your hands. You don't wanna throw this stiff, no. The more relaxed you are, the quicker, the quicker you could be when you're doing this technique. Just relax. Once you get to the target, that's when you clinch your fist, right? So here, hands up, body sideways, chin down, jab, cross, and feel it. And do, um, you know, try to get some reps, like do like 10 reps of 10. So for example, do 10 of these, relax, do 10 of the jabs, relax, do 10 of the back fists, right, relax, go back to 10. So you want to keep your arms moving, try to... Feel your technique, feel the energy, feel the, the punch. And the most important thing is, as well as try to get a, a punching back to hit. I know right here we're practicing, there's nothing that I'm hitting, but you, you wanna have this in application, you gotta hit a back. You gotta hit something. You gotta be able to you know, feel where the hands are landing. And then when you're sparring, you need a sparring partner to be able to practice your moves. So you're not just practicing one position. No, you're able to move around, be able to bob, weave, right, slip down, be able to throw your moves in. 
And, and it actually helps you to be able to be quick on the eye, quick on your hands, quick on reaction, all right? Most important thing is you be first. You be first, right? You see, you see an opening, be first. Move in, in. See an opening, move in. See an opening, move in. Bring it back to the face. Always move. Don't stay in one spot like this. Not like this. If this is the way you look in the mirror, this is no good. No. You want to be able to move around okay don't keep your head in the same spot come inside feel that energy come in right it's not just one two no as soon as it's coming in this right punch is already coming out bomb land already coming out bomb as soon as it's coming this one's already following it following it up right so here one and two Wherever you end up, wherever your opponent is, is one and two, right, coming in. So that's the way you do your jab right cross or your old one-two, right? So that's, that's it. Always keep your elbows down. Don't keep them up here. Not like this. Not cholo style, right? You don't want to do like cholo style. No. You want to keep this closed, okay, and bring it back. No, you want to keep your hands... Here, elbows down, this is, this is where you're able to protect. Not like this, not like this. You don't wanna fight like this either, no. Especially with somebody that could knee you or kick you, no, always, all right? Elbows down, throw your jab right, bring it back. Jab right, bring it back. So that's your um, uh, traditional jab right cross or your old uh, one too. So remember, always, Stepping forward when you're about to fight. In this case, I'm putting my left foot on front, hand up, and I'm starting with my same foot that I have on front, same hand starting the punch. And then I'm doing my right from the back. So it's not like I, I'm, I'm not just jabbing here and stepping forward right. No, 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 you're in one spot. So you're moving in with the jab and turn that hip to punch your number two, then bring it back. That's where you want to be. That, that's where the technique comes from. So practice your technique, practice your moves till you feel very comfortable, uh, you know, using these punches. You, you're feeling it in your, uh, your energy. You're feeling in your body that you're, you're moving correctly. See yourself in the mirror. Correct yourself every time. Correct yourself while you're sparring. You, and study yourself, study your opponent. Very important. So that's your old one too. Thank you for watching. Uh, go back and watch some of the other videos I, I posted recently and uh, talk to you soon.